Hi everyone, this is Heba from My Little Journal, and today I'm going to be working in my project life. This is week 34, 2018, and I'm going to be using a mishmash of different kits. I believe I end up with some Studio Calico, probably an Ali Edwards card. Um, I usually do that once I use my kits. I just dump all my cards together and then just try to match them with my spreads as I go. Now this week is full of photos from one occasion. It was our Eid holidays. And because I had so many pictures from that occasion, I decided to use my Alta New Happy Eid stamp set. I believe that's what it's called, but I always add all the links down below for you guys if you want to check it out. Now, uh, as you guys know, I'm originally from the Middle East and we do celebrate uh, Eid. So I thought the stamp set had to be in my stash. I knew I would use it over and over again. So I purchased the stamp set and I'm in love, you guys. Look how beautiful the font. This is in Arabic and then I stamped it in English. Um, I'm also going to be stamping week 34 and adding a little chipboard embellishment to this 4x6 card. But I am so in love with this stamp set. I'm so happy I purchased it. This is one thing I really love about Altenu. They have different languages um, that you can purchase. So if you are Asian, there's a stamp for you. If you are from the Middle East, there's a stamp for you. So I really love that. I actually purchased two stamp sets from them. One is just different phrases in Arabic writing. And I purchased the Happy Eid stamp set so I can use it um, on our holidays. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and stick down this chipboard and I'm moving on to that photo of my kids and I. Now, I started by using the other stamp set with the Arabic phrases. I thought I would stamp it in a label. And once I stamp it, I really didn't like how it looked. Usually these labels, um, Kelly Perky's labels, are glossy or you know sleek so when I stamped it I kind of moved a bit so I really hated it so I decided to stamp it on white cardstock or I think sticker paper and then stick it right above where I stamped it on that label just to cover it up and it looked so much better you could actually see what's written in that uh, or on that stamp so I did that, I liked it, but I didn't like it on my photo. <laughs> so I end up adding just a pink chipboard heart to that 4x6 photo and adding this little label that I created on that photo of my parents and I. This is where I decided that I like uh, just a plain heart chipboard on my photo and that I would use that label on a different picture. I'm gonna grab that picture, uh, trim it down because I wanted to back it up to this three x four card. I love the little speech bubble with the heart. So I wanted it to show and I'm gonna end up grabbing one of my Kelly Perky stamp sets and stamp out a little magic right above my bubble and I'm gonna add that label to the bottom of my photo. I like it so much more and it brought in that green to this photo. I'm also gonna be trimming down this three by four photo of my son with my parents and I decided to do that again because I wanted to use the 3x4 card that said reaching my goals one step at a time. Um, this is just a little kind of story and it just made sense with my photo um, just because of the conversation we had with my son that day. I added a little puffy heart and then I'm moving on to a marching band photo. Yes, a marching band photo. I said this before. Um, this is the season for my son's marching band pictures, uh, so they're always in my project life. I ended up stamping Better Together. I'm going to add a little puffy heart to that. Love this Better Together stamp set. It's an old Kelly Perky stamp set, but I love the font on there, and it just fit perfectly on this photo. 
I'm going to finish up my spread by adding a flare to this 3x4 card that says what matters most and then I call my layout done. You can see how fast and easy this spread came together. I love fast and easy spreads in my project life, especially when I'm behind. I love how this turned out, all that pink and green, love it. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and if you did, please give me a thumbs up. And if you are new to my channel, please consider subscribing. And I hope to see you guys very soon. Bye.